Hello, buddy. Welcome to Death Rips. Now, I have no idea what this game is about. I guess we're in a hotel and there is or isn't a serial killer in here. But we're going to get right into the game. Um, it's a horror game. Uh, I do not know how to play it. I just... Um, October. Okay, we're just going to get right into the game. Yeah, I have no idea what it is or how we play it. So let's get right into the game. October 31st, 2008. Inspector M. James uh, in a hunt for a serial killer named Lady Death. Last victim in this dreadful criminal. Found in this hotel. Lady James is currently in there. Fortunately for the inspector, the murderer is still there. Yeah, so we're the... So I guess we are... Oh, wow. Beautiful artwork here. Okay, so we can run. Um... Yeah. Got some beautiful radio going on. Can we get a Fanta? Oh, color. No. We short. I think we're short here. Beautiful front lobby desk, I'm guessing. Who in the hell is that? Teddy Roosevelt? He's feeding the dead guy soup. I like that. Okay. But I just noticed there is a key over here. Um, I have no idea what we're doing or how we're doing it, but here we go. Probably gonna need that later. Can we turn on the sports? We can't turn that off. Can we turn on the NFL game? I mean, uh. Can't go in there. Can we go in here? Of course we can. Can I just leave? Elevator is creepy as hell. Okay. Right in here. Hello. Hello. Can you guys hear me okay? Okay. Yeah. So. Oh. Yeah, that's great. Uh, yeah, that's, that's real good. A uh, dark corridor. Very nice in horror games, you know. Love those, you know. Nope. No. No. Oh my god, damn no. Yep. Are you kidding me? Okay. All right. All right. All right. Yeah. See. <laughs> oh God. Uh. All right. Yeah. Not bad. Very, very beautiful horror game. I mean, uh, they did the pictures good. They did all that stuff good. You know, um, yeah, so that's it, everybody. Uh, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. Uh, yeah, so, um, yeah. So, thank you, and bye-bye. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Anyway, uh, moving on. Okay. Oh, hell no. Anyway, guys, hello. Uh, this one is called Bad Parenting. I have no idea what this is called. It's a VHS horror. Um, looks pretty fucking creepy. Uh, you know, let's get right into it. So, I have no idea what the fuck any of this is. Hey, hey, hey. What the fuck? Hey! Done. 
Come on, you're home late again. Come on, I was busy with work. Can you have some sympathy for me? No. No, Mom. I must bring home my goddamn ramen. He didn't. Today's my birthday. It is my fucking birthday. Oh. oh, of course. I know that. And where is my goddamn ramen? Um, have you ever heard of Mr. Redface? The birthday of good children, Mr. Redface secretly leaves kids while they're asleep. Really? So I'll get my ramen? If you want to get your kid, you have to go to bed right away. I'm going to bed right now, Mom. What the fuck are you? Pulling the kid again. How many times have you come home to this... This. How many times have you come home late? I was working. And my shift ended late. Oh, shit. You still think I'm an idiot, don't you? Hey, little shit. Get back to your room. Don't stand here eavesdropping on growing up conversations. Okay. Yes, sir, Dad. Yep, right away, you bald fucking son of a bitch. I'd have fucking punch you around the mouth. Don't you fucking touch Mom. Mom, go get my ramen. Hey, you built like a goddamn 2 by 4 fucking Lego piece here. Fucking excuse me. Going to bed now. Thank you. Can I get my ramen, though? Can I get something to eat here? No, we don't have fucking shit to eat, so that's good to know. Thanks. Uh, I think my dad's gonna eat my ramen. Is this my room? Or is this... Why do I have a Mickey Mouse hand? The fuck? Hello, radio. Oh, the fucking radio was working in the other game. Why isn't this one working? You guys still doing good? Still alright? No. Uh, I'm gonna go to bed now. Thanks. Watch TV or. Can't even watch TV. Yep, can I have a some toilet paper so I don't shit myself? Fuck is it what is this for? Love the bed, you know, just on the fucking floor, I love it. Let's go to bed now. That was a good nap. I can't move, guys. Get under the covers. Hi, Dad. How's it going? Who the fuck are you? Oh, Mr. Redface. Hey, how you doing, man? Oh, you're here to bring my gift, huh? Doesn't look like ramen, though. Why is your face red? Because you can We know we know why his face is red, guys. Come on, it's easy to tell. It's really fucked up. I mean, the guy shot. The guy killed his mom. All right, and that's splattered his face red. Yep. So, what'd you put in the closet? That the get from Mr. Red Face? No way! Hey, I love this. It's not, not really, but I'm Ron. Hi, Ron. You can talk? Of course. Because I was created by magic. You even have the same name and appearance as me. That's right. My master made me just for you. But your neck seems a bit loose. It's okay. Sometimes my master makes some mistakes. 
This is just a small flock compared to the other dolls. What's important is that from now on, I'll be your best friend. That sounds wonderful. You want to play something with me? Not really. My master stored my toys in the closet. Can you get them for me? I don't fucking like you. I don't like you. I just wanted ramen. Simple ramen. 20 cents. You know, local Albertsons or, you know, Walmart. I don't want a fucking talking doll. You know, I didn't want my mom to be fucking exploding. I was just still stuck. Can you try that again? Yep, might as well. Let me try it one more time. Come on! I'm my best. Can't open it. Sorry, pod. Want me to do something else? I'm hungry. So am I! Your doll, can you even eat? No. You'll be the one eating. I'll be able to feel everything you eat. Oh, God. So I can easily understand you. Wow, that's amazing. Well, yeah, let's get some to eat here, buddy. Yeah, let's get right into it. Hey, how you doing? Hey, 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 Dad, how's it going? Okay. okay. Fucking merging, I'm in a fucking crazy-ass house with a crazy-ass doll. Fucking die. My dad's probably gonna snap my neck, because that's what the fucking doll is doing. What do we got? You're reading this letter at 1 p.m., aren't you, sleepyhead? I prepared your favorite dish in the fridge, so remember to heat it up before eating. Lately, I've noticed you've been eating, getting lazy about eating. You know I don't have much time at home. Please learn to take care of yourself and stop making... One more thing. Don't forget to take, out, take your medicine after eating. Okay. Hey, beautiful. Can I set you down? Okay, right fucking there, Georgie. Fucking there. Eat this up. And be eating some good din din. Or lunch, I guess. Taking my pills. You just calm the fuck down. Alright. Hey, your favorite dish? You want to see me perform some magic? Yes, please. Alright, I'll make this plate of food never run out. Every time you finish eating, the dish will be restored to its original state. The fuck? That's fucking amazing. Only if that was like cheesecake. Wow, that's amazing. What else can you do? I don't want to know what else you do. I just want to go... He's got fucking force from Star Wars. Making us drunk. He's making us drunk. <laughs> what the fuck just happened? I don't know. You guess. Oh no. The bottle. My dad's gonna whip my ass. I hope he's still asleep. Your dad? Don't worry. My master has taken your dad away. What? What did you say? Hey, my dad was a piece of... Can I take my pills now? Appreciate that, so... What do I do now? Can I go home? This isn't a fucking home. This is a prison! I'm going to bed now. Dad? Are you dead? You're dead, aren't you? You're dead. Hi, how you doing? Where's my dad? As I said, the master has taken your dad away. Why? Because your dad is a bad person. I agree with that. No, I do agree with that. He often hits and yells at you. Parents like that are taken away by my master to protect children like you. But this is too much. Your dad doesn't deserve that. He is a bad person. No, he's not. Please, let my dad go. I'm begging you. All right, all right. But my master won't like this. Quite a long way to where your dad is being held. You'll have to use a shortcut if you want to get there in time to save him. 
Show me the way. Crooked is drought. What the fuck kind of Narnia bullshit is this? Like what in the? All right. That what? Okay then. Mm -hmm. Well, in my closet we go, I guess, huh? I'm gonna fucking die anyway, but come on, dro oh, point me the way. You can't open it. That's disappointing. I guess we'll have to use your parents' closet then. What? What in the fuck? Yep, well, let's just go, you know, just full speed ahead, Georgie. You should know that these chests can function as portals. They can take you anywhere you want, including where your dad is being. Give it a try. Yeah, probably death. Probably, probably hell. There's nothing in here. All right, I forgot. There are a few steps you need to take in activating this shortcut. How the fuck do you forget? Bring your dad's radio and place it in front of the closet. Okay. It's well made. This radio will work like an elevator button. You need to select a frequency first. Choose the right frequency. The door will open to the place you need to go. Okay. What the f Seems like that's not it. Let's try again. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Elmo! Nope. That ain't it. Bye, pal. Is that it? You die? I think this is the one. Go ahead and step in. I'll stay here and watch the house. Fuck are you coming with me? You see that? You hear me? You're coming with me. Okay, I'll never see you never. And then get back. The fuck are you? What? I'll guide some bitch. What's up? I'm looking for my dad. Scribe. Dad's name is Bruce. Wait a moment. We're in hell, for sure. There are many Bruce's here. Any more details? Is this Bruce a good Bruce or a bad Bruce? Well, my dad is the kind of person who gets a bit angry. There's a bad Bruce. Let me see. There's still many bad Bruce's. More specific, please. What else did he do? He often yells. Still not enough information. Sometimes he hits me. And slaps, too. And? That's all. Doors behind you. Thank you. Officer Cat Hole. No! Oh! Where the fuck are you? Ooh. Ah, he just got startled. Who are you guys? Just like you. We're kids from our way to find our parents. We're staying here for a bit. Do you want to join us? I'm sorry. I'm in a bit of a hurry. Okay. See you later. Well, the fuck you won't. Fucking Porky over here. And Grave Diggy Jones over here. Fucking Tesla truck over here. I'm out of here. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. No. Let me back by the fire and the pussycat. Hi, Dad. Looking better than ever. You alright there? 
Your eyes look a little out of whack, but... Dad? Please. Please stop punishing me. It's me, Dad. Please. Stop punishing me. What has he done to you? Come on, let's go home. Mr. Redface will take both of us. Please. Please stop punishing me. Bell. Woo! I don't want to die. Hi. Hi, Mom. Your neck so bendy. Jesus Christ! Hey, what's wrong with you? Why are you hiding in the closet? Mr. Redface has taken Dad. Oh. Well, that's a good thing then. I'm not joking. It's a long story. Let me explain. How's your doll wrong doing today? Is it alright? Your doll? Um, how did you know about it? Of course I know. And he had have been taking your medicine today. Yeah, I told you to take his medicine. I told him. I told him, Mom. I told him. You know, I told him to take his medicine after he ate. And then this ma magical doll, you know, just made the food plate bigger. And then maybe go in this goddamn closet, you see. And now, you know, since I medication or hallucinating. Um, I, I told him, though. You know what I'm saying? This isn't the first time you've had the hallucinations. Every time you tell a different story. The common factor is always that stupid doll. Don't you remember the previous times? No. Ah, I don't know what's wrong with you. Just go to bed. Midnight already. He's got some pointy ass boobs. Pointy ass. Okay. Thanks, Mom. Appreciate it. Get the Roblox plants on. What was that? Ah! Yeah, that's fine. No, it's not. I need help, Mom. What just happened, son? Are you alright? No, I'm not fucking alright. I don't have my medication, Mom. God, you suck. What are you doing? You feel better now? Yeah, Mom. It's Mr. Redfit. Alright, tomorrow, I take a day off to stay home and take care of you. Really? Promise me, Mom. I promise. Now, go back to sleep. Yes, Mom. Damn. Ugh. Mom? Ah, you broken that promise again. God damn it, Mom. God damn fucking... Kitty Twinkler. Yep. Let's see what the note says today, shall we? Not even a fucking note here. Can I take my meds? I'm, ta I'm trying to take them, game. I'm trying to take them so I don't hallucinate. What kind of house is it? Fucking understand it. Fuck you, doll. Fuck you. Probably oh, gotta cross address, so. <gasps> what the? What happened to you? My master beat the shit out of me. He wasn't happy about what happened yesterday. I'm sorry. This is my fault. By the way, have you seen my mom anywhere? 
My master has taken her away. What? Just happened. I'm sorry. I couldn't stop him. You should run away because he'll come back soon to take you too. Now I have to say my mom and my dad too. Ow. Don't you see what he did to me? They look pretty fucked up, buddy. What's that? I found this at my dad's prison. Oh, it's Spell. I think it might help us defeat him. That is Spell to defeat Mr. Redface? Come on, quickly. Go into the closet and find where your mom is and being held. Yep, let's got it. Even, even though they fucking suck as parents. Might as well. Pussycat, I'm here again. Oh, she's, she's out. Okay. Kids, round them up. Come on. Don't be fucking scared. We face this demon bitch together. As one! Look, you throw the spell in here and take cover. I'm trying to. Come on, kids, don't be worried. Die, bitch! You know, I thought he was. I thought Mr. Redface was different, but. Ah, fucker! This game is not what I thought it was. See that, kids? With teamwork and determination, anything is possible. Okay. See you later. Ah. Where's our parents at? What's happened to you? The master has been defeated. The magic has cast on me is also fading. Are you disappearing? Don't worry. This is what I wanted. You should go outside and see your parents. Don't fucking tell me, tell it. Hey guys, how you doing? Dad, Mom, y'all are free now. Been having an affair, haven't you? I told you I was busy with work. Why? Neglected this family for another man. Aren't you ashamed to lie to your son? And what about you? Do you think you're better than me? You're just at home, leeching off all year round. What kind of father are you? No matter what I do, it's my business. I still bring home money, home to support my child. Well, you're not the best. I mean, you told me you were going to stay and you didn't. Okay. And if you still think I'm a whore, you're lowering yourself even below that. Oh, fuck you. One more word. Fine. You and I will get a divorce. One of us will have to move out of this house. I'll be here tomorrow. I'll take my son and leave. Stay right there! Um. How you doing, Dad? Doing alright? You look great. He is Mr. Redface. I was right. Is he killed her? I will not let this happen. What the fuck is going on? You know, I just you know just go with it, guys. He snapped my neck. That's my neck and I die. Yep. Oh my fucking god. And he hides my body in the fucking closet.
No. No. No! This cannot be true. Very sorry, Ron. Your closet. I think you're able to open it now. Fuck. Oh my god. This is me? Why don't I know anything about these? You've always known. Am I a doll? Because I am the knowing part of you. You've tried to deny and reject these things, and made up stories to make yourself feel better about you. And me, I had to find a way to lead you back to reality. I've tried so many times, so many ways to help you accept the truth as easily as possible. And every time I fail, that's what happens. Tick tock. Boom, all the memories disappear. You once again wake up at the starting point, which is the night your dad murdered you. How long have I been dead? Fourteen days. And I have been that long. What, really? What happened to my parents? As for your dad, he's hiding in a cheap motel room. My mom's head is fucking exploded. What the fuck? Oh, fuck. Come home with me, Dad. Don't you love me? Oh my god. What about my mom? She still seem, sees me, doesn't she? That's right, because she's only home late at night. But if it's daytime... Done? I thought our mom died, to be honest. What a freaky fucking game, bro. We got Slenderman as a fucking investigator? Do you have any clues about your husband's hiding place? Just drop something, ma'am. What is that? Motel card. That's that spell that killed Mr. Redface. But I'm not sure. Mine. Where he's held up. Killer father arrested. Good. Oh, that had a little... Oh, we're just a spirit or something? What a fucking game. It had so many like loop de loops in it. See, what I originally thought was I thought he was Mr. Redface because he shot the mom and his 
Does it flood? No. Wow. That was that was long, and that was I thought it was only like five minutes long because I thought it was just cheaply made, you know. But that was actually really good, really, really good, a really good game. Um, yeah, I mean, it was all. I mean, it just had so many like twists and turns. It was freaky, it was eerie, but it was like also like that parenting too coming soon. I'll have to play that one. But man, that was so freaky. So the husband. Wow. Like got in a fight again. And then mom's like, you divorce. I, she goes back out. He drinks. Really stupid. And then comes to my room. And just kills me. And then my mom. Tell him he's gone because he's at the hotel. And then she finds out that I'm fucking dead in a goddamn closet. Wow. What a goddamn game. Good, good fucking game. Kudos to the people who made the game. I mean, that was fucking creepy as all hell. But it was also so, like, sad in a way because it was like, what the fuck? But, uh, anyway, that was bad parenting, guys. Make sure to go support these, uh, people who made it because that was a very well made game for, uh, being, you know, VHS horror. It's really something eerie about that. Creepy as hell. But anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for being here. Uh, but make sure, please like, please subscribe, please, all that good stuff. Bear it up. Love it up. Anyway, that was bad parenting, guys. Very, very good game. So, thank you guys so much. And the first one we played, uh, <laughs> Death Trips. That was, that was even, that was even better than this one. Uh, I, you know, I, I mean, not really, but that was, uh, that got me. Pretty, pretty good, because that was, that was, that was, that was just funny, that was just funny, but I'll, I'll, I'll put that in the video anyway, because it's just, it's just funny, because I thought it was actually longer, I didn't think it would actually meant death trips, I thought you meant, meant like, tripping death or something, like someone took a whole bunch of ass and tripped until they died, but anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, love you all, and see you all later, uh, in the next video of whatever the heck we do, so thank you guys, love you all. Bye-bye.